Ralph, thank you so much, and I greatly appreciate uh, your words about Atlanta. I'm just really hoping the GSMA table over here heard all of that, taking notes. Uh, you, got, you got that? So, um, you know, really, this, is a, this has been a great journey. Um, whenever we started this journey, uh, my friend Lewis Gump, who was running mobility for CNN at the time, really echoed your words, Ralph, about mobility being the most transformational technology of our lifetime. And as we see it all come together, we see that it's true. Uh, my friend Tom Daly at Coca-Cola um, captured it this way. He said, this industry is not just hot, it's white hot. And I think that that's the, exactly where we are today in, uh, at the tip of the iceberg of this really exploding industry. So we got a couple more things to do over lunch. Uh, one, let's do something fun. Let's give something away. We announced a Twitter challenge earlier. Um, and we have a winner. And we have a winner of an AT&T LG GT phone. And um, got to be present to win. And uh, the winner we have is Jennifer Brignetti. Is Jennifer here? Okay. I'm going to shake your hand. But what you do is you go over to the AT&T booth in okay. the Experience Center later on and collect your prize. You. So congratulations. <laughs> the other thing that we want to do is we want to recognize some of the stars that we have in mobility. And with that, um, and with that I'd like to invite uh, a group of people who have been leading an effort um, to analyze and select these people. So if Keith Hartford and Chris Walters and George Machini would join me on stage. We have presentations. Great, I'm Chris Walters. Uh, my mic. Great, I'm Chris Walters. I'm the CEO of the Weather Company. Um, it's truly a privilege to be here and be associated with the Metro Atlanta Chamber Task Force on Mobility. Um, the innovation that's going on in the market is, is truly astounding. I'm relatively new to the market, having spent years in New York City, and a lot of what's going on. Um, Honestly, has been a bit of a surprise to me, but it's truly um, impressive. And we feel uh, great to actually have some small part um, in the innovation that's going on in the market. Many of you know the Weather Channel uh, and the Weather Companies. We've created some of the most um, used applications in the world um, across all mobile operating systems. Um, many of you may not know, we also actually serve many businesses. And so uh, when Ralph talked about airlines, actually about 85% of the airlines in the country are actually using tools from us for flight planning. They're using those applications uh, on, on iPads. Uh, and so we feel very privileged to have the position that we do in, in driving further growth and innovation in the market. So what we're here to do today is to uh, announce some of the Metro Atlanta Chamber's 2013 mobility stars. And there are four criteria that we use for the selection of these stars. Uh, one is leadership contribution in creating an effective mobility business model or solution. Um, two is the impact on global and national uh, mobility industry. Three is the impact on Atlanta's mobility presence through jobs, recognition, support, or personal contributions. And fourth is education and philanthropic impacts through mobility. And so there were so many wonderful nominations, really, really impressive contributions that are being made in the market. And so what we're going to announce today is the five that were selected. And so I'm going to turn it over to Keith, who will announce the first couple. Uh, Keith from WNA. Thank you, Chris. I'm Keith Hartford, and I've had the pleasure of working with Chris and other members of Atlanta's Mobility Task Force as the lead for Atlanta's Mobility Skilled Workforce Initiatives. Uh, WNA is a consulting project management and IT services company headquartered here in Atlanta. Uh, a significant portion of our business is focused on the communications and mobility industries. WNA is pleased to present Atlanta's Mobility Stars for 2013. Uh, our I'm going to ask uh, recipients when your name is announced to join us on stage, please, and remain up here. Uh, our first mobility star here in Atlanta has led an engineering team to develop a mobile application called Horizon Patient Folder MD that clinicians at hospitals use to review and sign medical records from their iOS mobile devices. Hospitals cannot bill their insurance providers until clinicians have signed off on all pending charts. 
By providing mobile access anywhere, hospitals can significantly reduce their accounts payable days when physicians complete the charts quicker. This can significantly reduce a hospital's operating cash flow. And any application uh, that makes healthcare easier for patients and lowers provider costs is definitely a winner. So please join me in congratulating Richard Brightwell, <laughs> software engineering specialist, imaging and workflow solutions for McKesson Corporation as one of Atlanta's mobility stars for 2013. Congratulations. Our next Mobility Stars leadership in the mobile product industry and application development has established the Weather Company as an industry leader and innovator. As president of the Digital Vision, he leads the teams responsible for the Weather Company's mobile and digital applications, interactive television, consumer and application software, and product development for Weather.com and the Weather Underground. His work has resulted in the widespread availability of content through the Weather Company's mobile and application presence, which reaches more than 50 million mobile consumers monthly, along with more than 100 million unique web consumers through Weather.com. In addition, the Weather Channel app is ranked the number two iPad app and number seven for the iPhone, according to Apple's list of top 25 all-time most downloaded free, app, free and paid apps. So that's a little piece of Atlanta being carried around by everyone uh, who's mobile. Uh, his impact on the product industry has been widely noted, and he was recognized on the 2013 Business Insiders list of the 29 most important people in mobile advertising. Under his leadership, the Weather Company received recognition on the Advertising Age 2013 Digital A-List. He represents the Weather Company as Global Chair Emeritus of the Mar uh, Mobile Marketing Association, and he participates in several other mobile industry groups. Please join me in congratulating Cameron Clayton, President, Digital Division for the Weather Company, as one of Atlanta's mobility stars for 2013. Now I'd like to introduce George Machini, CEO of Catavolt, to announce our additional stars. Thank you, folks. I'm George, CEO of Catavolt. Uh, Catavolt is a cloud platform that takes very big enterprise systems and gets them uh, to be usable on mobile devices in a very secure and simple way. Um, thank you to Eric from our team for being part of the Mobility Skilled Workforce and the Selection Committee for this great award. Our next Mobility Star is uh, the CEO and President of AirWatch. And at AirWatch, he drives the company's strategy and operations. Under his leadership, AirWatch has grown before our eyes to be the leader in enterprise mobility management. In February 2013, he secured a $200 million Series A financing, one that is the largest of any technology company across all the spectrum for a long time. He announced at the beginning of 2013 that AirWatch would be adding 800 new jobs in Atlanta, solidifying Atlanta as one of the fastest growing mobile hubs in the US. He's a board member on the Georgia Tech Information Security Center as an industry advisory board member. He's recently selected as the Ernst & Young Enterprise of the Year. He uh, won the 2012 ATP Award, and he's just made an enormous impact on our uh, Atlanta community. Please join me in congratulating John Marshall, CEO of AirWatch. And John is actually not with us today at this lunch, so uh, accepting the award. Oh, he's here. Yeah. There he is. Congratulations, John. Excellent. All right. Our next uh, star is an Atlanta mobile veteran who's worked tirelessly to bring adoption and attention to the Atlanta's mobile commerce uh, scene. Prior to leading IHG's uh, America's division, in uh, mobile marketing. She served as the Director of Programs and Planning at Atlanta-based GSMA. Her skills, effort, and strategic insights have led IHG to double their mobile 
uh, revenues from just over $148 million in 2011 to a whopping $330 million in 2012. Really amazing. Um, please join us in congratulating uh, Lisa West, Manager of Mobile Marketing for IHD. Great. So we have one final star to recognize. Um, I think this one is an absolute no-brainer, and I don't think you'll be surprised by, by who we're recognizing. Um, he's absolutely a mobile Hall of Famer. Um, you just heard from him earlier. He's the president and chief executive officer of AT&T Mobility, a position he's had since October of 2007. He's responsible for AT&T's largest growth engine. Uh, under his leadership, AT&T is the industry's mobile broadband leader and number one smartphone provider. He serves as the Chief Executive Officer and President of Mobility and Consumer Markets at AT&T with responsibility for consumer marketing, sales, customer care, operations for its wireless and wireline business. He previously served as the President of Bell South International. He's been involved in the Apple's development of the iPhone and GM's development of the connected car. Um, He's ubiquitous as an industry champion, is regularly ranked in the top five most powerful people in wireless. Outside of work, he serves on the boards of New York Life, the Georgia Aquarium, and the Metro Atlanta Chamber. He's extensively involved in nonprofit and community organizations, serving as the chairman of Junior Achievement Worldwide and the chairman of Hispanic Initiatives for the Boy Scouts of America. He was inducted into the Hispanic Scholarship Fund's prestigious Alumni Hall of Fame for his achievements and contributions in service to America. Please join me in congratulating Ralph De La Vega, President and CEO of AT&T Mobility. Great. Thanks again to the Metro Atlanta Chamber and WNA for their sponsorship of this. Um, and one last round of applause for the, the winners.